Yeah. Oh, 12, that was Candace. Calm a complexion, body like Kevin, and she was a dancer. Capricorn or Aquarius, but she remind me of a cancer. She called, I would answer. Late night phone session with the camera. She trying to make a movie on the plasma. She moving like a pro, no amateur. Sex drive, got stamina. She would ask, could I handle her? Then I'm a damager. You in need of a manager. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to another vlog. Oh, my God. <laughs> I look a fucking mess. So, I washed my hair, blew it dry, and flat ironed it. But it looks a mess. I'm kicking off this vlog so doggone late. Like, it's like 3.30. I just, I just now dropped my mom off. I need to head to the store to pick up a bottle so I can make it to the kickback. I don't know, cause the kickback starts, haven't they said it starts at five o'clock? I ain't nowhere near ready. I don't even know what the heck I'm gonna wear. I haven't eaten anything. I'm trying to do this. I'm trying to like slim down in like 14 days before my trip. I don't know why I be doing this to myself. Like I put myself through so much torture. Like I put my body through so much torture. I know my body be like, bitch, come the fuck on. Like, come on, come on. <laughs> and I'm really not trying to drink for real for 14 days. I might get some skinny girl margarita, but I doubt if anybody even gonna drink that. Or I might just get some Tito's, a bottle of Tito's, because you know they say that Tito's is like lower in carbs. Like it's it's the best. If you're trying to watch your weight, but you still want to drink, Tito's is the best thing to drink. You really shouldn't be drinking nothing if you're trying to, you know, lose some weight. Okay, so the kickback starts at five. I'm not nowhere near prepared. It's after 3.30. I still gotta go pick up my mom. She gets off of work at seven. Make it back all the way back to the house, which we are like half an hour. She lives, she works like damn near a half an hour away. I don't care what this GPS says. This GPS says 18 to 20 minutes. No, this is like a half an hour. And then make it to the kickback. So I'll probably be getting there like around eight o'clock. Hopefully the kickback is still going on. I'm like one of them type of girls, like I like to be on time for stuff. Like, and if I'm like, if I'm late for something, I don't like to be too late. Like, if I'm like 30 minutes late, that's fine. But hours, I don't know. Good thing it's a kickback and not like a freaking in-service meeting. <laughs> I really need to clean my car out. My car looks a mess. Like, I need to clean my car on the inside and outside. I really need to get my car detailed for real. I just don't be having time. And then I drive so much, so it's just like, what's the point of getting your car detailed when it's gonna get back filthy all over again. But I don't know, I'm just thinking about it. I'm just thinking all out right now. But anyways, I am about to head to Kroger's to the liquor store. I was drinking this one, one of the twins had brought it. Well, both of the twins had brought this alcohol. It's called Licks. One bought a margarita and the other one brought a mojito. And they said they got it at Family Dollar. I went to my local Family Dollar and I could not find it, but I did find it at Kroger and it's the bigger size, like the huge size. So I might just get that and take that to the kickback or I might just get a bottle of Skinny Girl. I don't know. I'm just really trying to not overdo it with the drinking. It's mainly when it's at my house. Now if I'm at a function, I know how to control myself. But when I know it's liquor in the house and it's accessible, like I always gotta have me a drink. I don't overdo it. Like I don't get messed up, but I gotta have me a drink or two. So I'll probably just buy that and just leave it there. I think it is so tacky to bring liquor to a function and then take your liquor back home. Is that just me? Like, is that just me? Or, I don't know, I just think it's tacky. I, I think it's tacky when people take their liquor back when they are at a function. I don't do that, y'all can have this shit. <laughs> I, I, I'm not hard up on no damn liquor. You can have it. When I had my house party, for my birthday when we was on call when we was on that lockdown when everybody was on a curfew i didn't film that y'all i don't know why i did not film that video because the party turned out really nice but i noticed that everybody who brought liquor they took their liquor back 
like they took it with them when they left like why did y'all take in liquor man and this was the time that everybody was getting money trump was giving out them trump checks <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why people was taking their liquor back. I just think that's just so rude. I think um, that just displays like no coop at all. Like people who take back their liquor at a function, like here is the bottle, baby. You can have it. <sighs> I don't know. Ooh, the sun is, ooh! It's golden hour. Okay, sun. All right, y'all, so this is what I was talking about. So I do want to buy these, but why are they so fucking big? Like I'm looking for the regular size like this. Like this is so huge. Like the mojito, oh my gosh, so freaking good. Um, I also tried the strawberry margarita. That was delish too, but the mojito was the best. It got like this real nice minty flavor that I was feeling. So. I think I'm gonna grab this. Or I don't know, I might get this Cayman Jack Margarita. This is good too, this'll get you woo, messed up. This plum wine is so, so good, so good. I actually just finished the last little bit that I had yesterday. And bam, just like that, she is dressed, got on about five different shades of black. <laughs> Y'all, I was gonna get dressed, dressed, but I decided to keep it kind of simple because i just got off the phone with heavenly and she said girl we just over here watching uh this one show so it, it seemed like it's real laid back and chill so i got on this hoodie ain't this hoodie so cute hold on let me see if i can show y'all the back oh wait okay y'all see that y'all ain't the back of that cute oh so i got this hoodie from this nigga's face that i used to sit on all the time it's like <laughs> And I ain't necessarily used to sit on his face. Oh, God, I hope he is not watching this. Put on some black leggings, y'all. I don't want y'all coming in my comments talking about some, this girl wear the same black leggings. Like, I literally have, like, 10 pairs of black leggings. I, I mean, I could count them out for you. I got on my fake Yeezys, y'all. These is fake as fuck. I got these from Rainbows during the summertime for 12 bucks. But you can't even tell. You can't tell. Like, I like Yeezys, but I don't like Yeezys enough to pay for real ones. So, yeah, I, I'm going to buy the fake ones. Yes. This is the fit. And y'all like these earrings? Um, uh, where I get these earrings? From Micah's? Mika's? Micah's? Yeah, so that's the earrings. And then I got on my Anna Luisa bracelet. But, yeah, y'all, I'm keeping it real casual. Keep it Oh, let me show y'all this coat y'all so i'm thinking about wearing this coat with it y'all think this is doing too much or no i actually got this coat a long time ago i want to say two years ago i got this coat from Kohl's. yeah the coat was originally like a hundred and something it was like a hundred and 30 something dollars but i got it on sale for like 60 bucks and i could not turn it down i never ever wore this before but i thought it was cute just add a little pizzazz i mean i'm about to take it off anyway but i thought it was like kind of cute to wear with this yeah no i don't know all right oh my shoulders look broad it's giving uncle fester so i'm gonna keep i'm gonna keep the coat on but i threw these glasses on that i got from shein too like, it's giving hood chic. It's giving street chic. It's giving take me to the hood in Paris. That's what it's giving. All right, y'all, let me go. Let me quit playing with y'all. Come on, y'all. Get in the car. It's time to go. What does Neo got to change now that he's alone? I need another round, friend. Oh. No, no, no. It's so sick. It's so sick, son. Okay, well, this Neo got to change oh. now that he's alone. It's so sick song. So now that I'm alone. He got to change his number. Okay, what else? Can't pick up the phone. Keep going. Oh, go back. Go back. Go back. Hold on. It's the first, it's the first line. Got to change my answer on that. Hey! Mary J. Blige searching for everybody. I'm searching for a real love. <laughs> LC, what is a guy that thinks he's fly? Bruh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I know too many of them. Damn, a letter C. <laughs>
get it. I need some more candy. I ain't about to get I it. I'm telling Jordan went to on Friday night. This is how we do. Where was like, the party that my Friday night and I feel like on the west side. On the west side. Yeah. Trey like, doesn't want to leave, but what does he I gotta do? Gotta go right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gotta go, I gotta go. According to Alicia Keys, some people live for fortune, fame, power, and what else? Some people mm -hmm. live for mm -hmm. fortune, power, some fame. people live for the Some people live for the power. After that, for the power, the power yeah. what else? Some, some people live, live just to play the game. game. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Of the girl that D'Angelo met in Philly. D'Angelo the singer, how does it feel? Yeah. How does he? Is it in that song? What was the name of the girl that he met in Philly? I don't know this. I don't know this one either. Oh. <laughs> what can't Deborah Cox and RL be? Why can't Deborah Cox and RL be friends? I'm still in love with you. Yeah, because they're still in love. Yeah. Yeah. That's my shit. That's my favorite. What did Adina <laughs> Howard say? She got on. Everybody knows. Jimmy throw them my panties on. Liar. <laughs> in liar, what did Kobe say? Kobe said, "Hey, Jimmy, you know what I'm saying? Like, I like what you say. Like, you know what I'm saying? 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 Like, you know what I'm
thousand. I need a thousand ones. <laughs> <laughs> That's insane. Next month, my dad. And what? He bought me. What did he say? Ask him if the can. No, ask him if he can give me a pregnancy test. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, what are you going to call you by right now? What the fuck? <laughs> a few moments later. Hello? take my mom to work what i got going on uh also about to buy my ticket for me on me <laughs> and i heard that it's cheaper to buy your ticket at miami i mean it's cheaper to buy your ticket at the airport what the fuck am i talking about I'm about to do that i saw on hopper that the tickets are 118 dollars one way I already paid for my ticket to go back because they were so expensive, but I just got to get my ticket to get there. I do that sometimes. Sometimes I don't do round trips. Sometimes I'll just get the ticket. Um, I'll get a one way months in advance. And then when it's like kind of close to the, to the trip, then I'll get the one way coming back or whatever but yeah so i'm about to go get that and then i also i got a full day today i actually got up and got moving at 12 o'clock in the afternoon which i never do that i gotta do laundry i need to work out i need to film for self-care saturday for next saturday and then i'm also filming for another video I might make this a self-care Saturday video as well. I'm like literally filming for like two videos at one time. No, three videos at one time because I'm filming for this one right now. So yeah, so I got a lot of stuff to do before I lay down because it is Sunday and y'all know I gotta be at work like mad early. So yesterday was a vibe like always. I love getting together with the girls. I love hanging out with Kayla and Heavenly and Kayla's sister. I think her name is Kiana. I, I had a good time last night. It was very minimal. It was very, it was very minimal, but it was very high vibrational. So I had a good time. I got a little tipsy, a little bit. Yeah, so I started getting drunk off of the licks because that's all I drank that night. I started getting a little tipsy off of that and then I immediately cut myself off and then I sobered up. But I was just so sleepy and then my phone ended up dying. So, and then it started raining. It rained real bad too. So, yes, but I, anyways, <laughs> I still had me a really good time. Um, I hope we can do this soon. Well, actually, Heavenly's birthday is coming up. So she's having a birthday dinner. So I will be there for I will be there for that. You guys are coming with me. I ain't never seen you walk this fast unless you we here. got work. To all do. right, all right, I'm coming. Did you grab my <laughs> when he blew up. <laughs> I don't feel good. Oh, do we? Uh, uh, can we go outside? 
was oh. We had the guy that was playing the prince though. Oh. Well, at least that man made it to the trash can. We got half to the trash can. Oh. Hey, how are you? This beautiful lady over here was helping me last time. Mm -hmm. Oh, so she ain't beautiful. Yes, she I is. Play? <laughs> I want my daughter's talk, ticket. Can you talk to Katie about it? Hey, it's just so busy. I can't. And we passed each other. We were going to try to do some stuff. And then she said, give me a second. And then she can come back. <laughs> You went one way around trip. One way. She needs one way ticket to, to, to Fort Lauderdale. Okay. And what's the price? Twenty nine. Twenty nine. Uh huh. I forgot to do that. Oh, the twenty nine. Yes. And it, it was a uh, correct flight. Yes. What time? I had the ten o'clock. I think. Ten thirty eight. Uh huh. Okay. Is that the one that's one fifty seven? Do you have one that's a little bit cheaper? I have one that's ninety four ninety. Okay. What time? That'll work. Okay. <laughs> How are you doing? I wasn't BSO. Okay. Did you change your number? No. I tried to call you. 694. Swear she got all the friends in the world. I'm calling. Sis, I'm sorry. Yeah, I got it. Say hi to all my YouTubers. Hey, y'all. Hey. <laughs> this is the husband person. Get yeah. out of here. I'm out of here. That's my sis, y'all. Love you too, sis. I'll see you later. I'm back. I'm back at the house. Ended up going to the grocery store. I got a couple things from the grocery store. I didn't really go full blown, full on grocery shopping because the grocery store is freaking packed. Like, why is there so many of y'all here? Like, I know Christmas is coming up, but Christmas ain't until when? It ain't this week, is it? I don't know. I got some stuff off of Amazon. As y'all know, I'm trying to pack and get my outfits and stuff my looks together and i know my homegirl she was like she gave us a full itinerary of what's going on in miami which i feel like is perfect because i did not want to overpack and i didn't want to overspend on things to on things to buy so she said on new year she wanted all, all of us to dress up in our flavor of love dresses so when she said that I already knew the motif that she was going for. I was sitting up here looking and looking and looking and looking for dresses and things of that nature. And I'm like, bitch, you got shit in the closet. So I, I got this dress, this little cocktail dress. And it's a cocktail dress. And I wore it to a wedding, a wedding, a wedding reception like two years ago. And I literally had the dress on for like, 10 minutes not 10 minutes but for like two three hours so i'm like why don't i just wear that dress but for some reason like i'm in this glove mood like i want to get some gloves i want to wear gloves so i got these little gloves it's a ruche it's a black ruche dress like anybody who knows me knows like on new year's i always have to wear black i don't know what it is like i have to wear black or i have to wear sequins or silver so yeah so i got these gloves to go with the dress let me see if I can, hold on, let me see if I got the dress. All right, y'all, so I can't find the dress. I think I put the dress up for the winter, but I'm gonna dig that dress up. And yeah, so I wanted to wear gloves for some reason. I just was into like some nice glam gloves. So I got these little ruched sheer gloves off of Amazon and I just opened the pack. I ain't even try them on, but let me try these motherfuckers on and see if they even fit. Oh, okay. Oh, these is cute. Okay. Mm, where is my champagne? Hold on. Let me see if this look good with a ring on. Hold on. Let me put this ring on. Oh, oh, uh-uh. Bitch, you can't tell me shit. Bitch, bitch, you can't tell me shit. Hold on. Let me get a bracelet. Hold on. Bracelet. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Get away from me, poor people. Unhand me, poor people. <laughs> Together. I'm going to change the ring, of course, but... Oh, that's... She wanted to do, like, a tea party. And y'all, when I tell you she showed us the location for this tea party, it is so 
fire. So I guess the venue or the restaurant I'm going to is like an old airplane. Y'all, when I tell you aesthetically, I'm gonna be I'm going to be filming my ass off. I'm gonna be taking so many pictures. So she wanted to do a tea party. I had got these two dresses off of Shein. I don't know which one I'm going to wear. I'm gonna see which one will fit. <laughs> so the first one that I got was this. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot it comes with pearls. So I got this little dress. It is so cute. Oh, and it got stretch. I didn't think this had stretch on it. So I got this dress. And then it comes with these pearls. And you hook the pearls up. I think right here. If it don't get hooked up right there, it gets hooked somewhere around the waist. But I got to look at the picture again. And this is the second dress i don't know which one i want want to wear so this is the second dress this is like a tweed type dress but i don't know with all this ass i got i don't think all this ass gonna fit in this dress baby got too much of it i'm gonna try this dress on and see if it fit and uh-uh not this button just drooping like that Nah, we're going to have to sew that on tighter. I think, ah, I don't have it zipped up, but I kind of feel like this one is the one. I'm going to hike them up. I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I'm going to hike them. <laughs> Only thing that I wish about this dress is that I wish it had cups in it. I wish it was cups built into it. And actually, I'm going to hit up my seamstress and see if she can put some cups in here because I can't, this ain't gonna work. And yeah, that white dress, that white dress was not getting past my ass. My butt is just so freaking big. All right, y'all. So I am about to go ahead and end this vlog. About to take me a little power nap and I'm gonna get up and exercise. So yes, y'all, so I love y'all so much. Thank y'all so much for watching my video. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next one.